today we're going to create a balancing sculpture and you can see the one I've created behind me and we're going to learn about balance, stability, center of mass, and equal distribution of weight. So what I need you to do is to gather some random things and you can see I've used some really kind of crazy things. Um, you can use construction paper, bottle caps, balloons, marshmallows, gummy bears, um, anything that you can really stick a um, skewer into will work and you will need a carrot. So if you can gather the, some of these things that I've listed below, we will get started. Okay, I started with just a regular toothpick and break it, not quite in half, maybe, you know, I don't know, break off a quarter of it. You can get rid of that and then take the sharp end and stick it into the base of your carrot. Okay? So if you tried to balance that like this right now, you know, there's no way it's going to balance. But what we're going to find is really interesting is when we start using these pieces and dropping the center of mass and working on the stability, you're going to be able to balance that carrot on top of your your bottle. So let's get started. So as you can see I've got my toothpick stuck in the bottom of my carrot and I've created two balancing sticks on either side and voila it balances on top of the water bottle on just that tiny little stick. So what we can do at this point is to experiment with the balance and with stability and put some more sticks with balancing items on the end and let's see how many of them you can put on to create your sculpture. You can see I've done some balloons, some bottle caps, I cut some shapes out of construction paper and colored on them and um, you can end up with a really very creative sculpture and amazing how it can all balance just on the tip of that toothpick.